My name is John Cannon. I'm a Chagas Advisor based in Letterkenny and I work with the sheep industry in Donegal. And uh, I'm a Michael Duffy's advisor. And uh, the type of operation Michael carried out here would be typical of a number of farmers in Donegal. Uh, traditionally, the, uh, there's a lot of store lambs here, a lot of hill farmers here haven't enough greenland to finish their lambs, so they have to be finished on, on either lowland farms or indoor on meal feeding. What determines what farm, whether farmers sell their lambs or, or keep them, it, a lot depends on the grass supply they have and the price. Traditionally, a lot of hill farmers wouldn't have enough greenland to finish their lambs anyway and have to sell, but those that have maybe adequate, adequate grass would tend in some years, if the price for live lamb is good, they would let them off because the, the risk in keeping them may be too high and if the weather turns bad, you know, grass, can, grass supply can disappear very quickly. There, there are quite a lot of far, uh, hill farmers finishing lambs both on grass and on concentrate diets. Uh, they, for an example, the, the better farm David McLaughlin in the last number of years would tend to finish his lambs on concentrate diets. It would be on grass maybe up to November and then all concentrates and finished off as, as they reach the, the target weight. As regards to finishing lambs, farmers in general are, are quite happy to finish their lambs if the price is, is adequate and there's, there's a good market there. That, but it all depends from year to year. Now, with, with, recently, with, with all the work that has been done in, in research in Athen Rai in, in regard to finishing of store lambs, farmers have a lot of information there now at, at their disposal when they go to purchase and uh, as regards the performance, the, the feed conversion ratio and the, the kill out they can expect and a lot of them are using that, that data when, when making decisions as to whether they, they should uh, keep their lambs or, or sell them. This year, grass supply is very good on many farms. Uh, but, and uh, there's a very good market uh, for store lambs driven by you know, farmers in the east of the country. So uh, uh, this year a lot of farmers are tending to sell their lambs live. And that could be at hill lamb or lowland lamb and nobody can hardly blame them for that.